morning everyone so I've actually been up and awake since half past six but um, we had Storm Katie like with us overnight so it was quite bad the weather's been really bad um, really windy really wet I don't know I had a really bad feeling when I woke up this morning and I said to Graham oh my god we better check on Rosie because she's in like a little plastic house I mean it's not sustainable it's not gonna like hold out on winds or anything it's not heavy enough and what do you know the whole house had blown away and our garden's like covered in all of our stuff like the barbecue has fallen over and like lots of things have blown all over the garden um luckily rosie's absolutely fine and she actually was sheltering the the, the slide has fallen down and she was actually sheltering behind that um, Graham's had to put her in Chewy's dog pen uh, for the meantime until he comes back up and sorts her pen out, um, sorts her house out and gets a, gets something else sorted for her. She's absolutely fine. We've put her behind um, the pallet panellings, the fence that I painted, so it's blocked from the wind. So she's totally fine there. I fed her already this morning. Um, but yeah, it's just been really, really bad weather this morning. I've actually been editing for the last, say, 40 minutes, my video from yesterday. And I'm just about to get up and get some breakfast. Today is Bank Holiday Monday, so everybody's still off work. Well, not everybody, but a lot of people. Um, and I'm actually seeing my friend Lynn today. She's one of my friends that I meet up with three other girls usually there's usually four of us we're kind of really good friends we've known each other for the past 12 years I think we, we used to work together when we were in college and, and yeah we're going for afternoon tea she, she actually suggested um, a really nice afternoon tea with the children apparently they do a child's afternoon tea as well <clears throat> So, um, yeah, and apparently where this place is, there's a little, I'm looking at the weather, it's rainy. Um, there's a little forest walk as well. So depending on the weather, we may just venture out. And I've got, I'm going to bring waterproof to wellies anyway. But yeah, that is basically planned for today. We're going to have a lovely afternoon tea out. Fingers crossed the kids behave. My friend Lynn is really good with the children. So um, she's really hands on and she just, yeah, she just entertains them really well. So I think... It, you know, it should be totally fine. Me and Alistair are just having giant crumpets for breakfast. It's 10 past eight. Violet actually is still totally sound though. She's like, yeah, I've checked on her a few times. She's shuffled, but she's sound asleep. Um, I'm actually gonna do my ironing this morning just because it's kind of, they're looking at me and I need to do it. So I'm gonna do that after my breakfast and I'm gonna put a DVD on, I think. I'm gonna put, what film should we put on? Paddington? Yeah. It's Paddington. Paddington Bear. That one hasn't come out on Sky and I'm so pleased we bought it a long time ago, but it still isn't on Sky, so I think I might put that on because I quite like that. Is it Rosie? You can see the state of her house demolished. It's clearer now though. Look at that. Let's hope it stays this way now. The wind is definitely gone. Paddington, got my ironing board out, ironing, Riley's awake, <gasps> aren't you lucky girl, huh, come on then, come on then, let's see them, you want pink, yeah first, then you can put the sparkles on this hand, okay, that's mine from last night, Ooh, nudie. Shiny. Shiny. Ooh, pretty, pretty, aren't they? But the little bits, mm. not I did all. one glittery one. The little oh, bits look. got sparkly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're making their imagination. What are you making? Oh, no. You're pulling bits out. Kids are doing some Eastery crafts. Mummy, do you like my bunny? Oh, that's gorgeous. Violet's doing these little um, ornament things, painting those. They're actually really quite cute. Um, we had one. Those. We had one before. We could put these on our Easter tree. 
And then Alistair is making these very cool shrinky things. I've never done and these before. And we could put these on this tree. We this could. Tree. Not because they're an Easter tree. Um, so you colour them in and then you cut them out and pop them in the oven and they shrink down into little things and you put the key pops on. So, don't worry, it's absolutely fine. So yeah, they're busy crafting. It's uh, 25 yeah, past no, 10. I've actually been um, putting pictures on for my cream egg cheesecake. I've already posted it, so um, I will try and link it below if I remember, but it is on the blog um, if you want to know how to do the recipe. It's very, very simple and you don't have to bake it or anything. It's just easy. Start uploading, still uploading, it's still at 40%. Um, ages, oh, it's so frustrating. I'm just trying to decide what to wear for today. The weather has, Basically, well, it looks better. It says it's supposed to rain at some point, like it does all the time, but it's been a bit windy. But it looks nicer than what it was this morning. I'll show you the kids' clothes, actually. So, Violet is going to wear this today. She's going to look really cute. She hasn't worn this skirt yet. This is um, from the Little Bird range, and I got it in the sale. I got it in the age four to five because she's quite tiny in the waist. Um, so, yeah, I got that in the sale, and then she's got the little socks. These ones you can actually get from eBay. They're like one ninety nine or something from China, I think. Um, and I got the grey ones and the black ones ages ago, but she hasn't worn the brown ones yet. She's got a little knitted cardigan, and then she's also got the little bird blouse, which she's had for ages. So I think that's quite a cute outfit. She's going to wear some little boots as well with it. And Alistair is wearing some cords, which are from H&M. I always get him in the six to seven. They seem to fit him the best at the moment. Um, and then he's got a Zara top with a bear on it. And then he's gonna wear his shirt, which is from H&M, over the top of like an extra layer. He's been sorting out stuff to get the kids ready for our trip out. Got to like change the clothes and because we're going for a walk after, they've got their gadgets in the car because it's not that local. Snacks, water, just fed Rosie as well. She seems settled now. Um, so yeah, we're gonna leave the after tea isn't booked till half one, but I've got to go to my friend's house. She lives near Eastleigh. So that's gonna take a little while and then from there it's on further. So um yeah, it's gonna be a little bit of a trip today, but it should be fun and we're supposed to be going for a nice like forest walk depending on weather. So I've got to change like I've got to bring like waterproofs and our wellies and stuff as well to change into. And um, the kiddies did these little shrinkies things. We've never done this before. I think they're super cute though, some supplies. I've only threaded a couple. But from the size they were, which were about this big, I think they've turned out really, really well. We have literally just got ready packed up in the car and we are heading off. Okay. <laughs> well, it's got an apple. Yeah, we are heading on our way. It's like quarter, quarter to 11. I just looked at the time and I was like, quarter to 11? No, that's not right, it's quarter to 12. <laughs> I still haven't changed my time.
we are home. It's quite late, it's 10 to six. We got home probably about half past five. I've just been, you know, when you've been out for the day, you've had so much stuff. I've basically just been putting everything away and back and things in the wash. We had such a lovely afternoon tea with my friend um, at a place called Lily's in Wickham. Never been there before, but she recommended it and she'd been there a few times. Really lovely, they do a proper kids high tea as well, which was really nice. Um, Rosie's, Graham's just been feeding Rosie. Hello. I haven't seen Graham all day, so we need some time together. Um, but yeah, and then we went for a lovely forest walk at 100 Acre Woods, which was really, really nice. And the kids got really muddy and like wet and it rained and it was just a really good day. Um, but yeah, a long drive back and now I'm knackered. How was she? Did she drink her milk? Oh, all of it then. Violet, what are you eating, Vi? Mm. She had a little nap on the way home. Simple, simple dinner. I'm pleased I decided to do this. Smoked salmon, cream cheese bagels. Do you want one? Are you hungry still? It's cream cheese. Do you want a bagel? Should yeah. I make you one? Yeah, and the cucumber. Do you want some salmon in it? Yeah. Okay, here's a yummy one from after. Multi seed wholemeal. Right, makeup is off. Um, comfies are on. The kids are in their pajamas and basically said they can watch a movie with a treat. They've got obviously their Easter treats and then they'll be going to bed. So yeah, most likely it's like 25 to seven. So most likely they'll be going to bed about quarter to eight probably. Eight o'clock latest. Um, we're also gonna have a treat. They actually had smoked salmon bagels. I didn't actually want one. I just, I'm too full up. I really don't fancy one because we had such a big hefty, kind of late lunch I suppose. By the time I actually come out, it's about two o'clock so. Yeah, I was totally full, but they've eaten, well, they had half a bagel each, and Graham had um, a whole bagel as well. So, yeah, they're gonna have a treat. You're gonna get your pajamas on, come on. No. You're the only one. Me. Is that your treat, Vi? <gasps> they've swapped. They've swapped? Because mm, she had a white one, and he had a chocolate one, and he didn't want white chocolate, and she didn't want milk chocolate. Hmm. Well, as long as they're happy, what we're we watching then, Robin Hood. Puss in Boots. Puss in Boots. We watched that this morning. We watched it yesterday. Right, we're going to watch Puss in Boots then. Mummy, yep. <laughs> my. Just straight down. I think Alistair should give Violet an arm wrestle. I think that would be funny. I've got mummy and me. Ready? Go. Like that. Like that. Right, ready? Wow, you're strong. Really? I'm strong at them. I'm strong at them, mummy. Ready? Yeah. Go. Ah! Ah! <laughs> You're the winner. You won me, a daddy. Mine and daddy's treat. We're gonna share. I'm not really a Thornton's fan. I think it's really. Quite horrible chocolate, actually. Large chocolate, definitely better than Thornton's. I'm, I'm gonna finish this off. Lots of washing to fold up. Tea, treats. Mm. Good. What's your mummy? Come in. Whoa. Put your all your teddies around you. Do you want them up there? Huh? Do you want your teds up there? No, I like them down. Okay. Just